17 most amazing recent creations. Number 17, Edible Cutlery. The Bakey's Bakery in India has created a new spoon that is completely edible. It's made out of either wheat, rice, or sorghum, and it's supposed to help cut down on plastic waste. The spoons don't dissolve on liquids and come in multiple flavors such as cumin and ginger garlic. Interesting. Number 16, Sound Sense. This little gizmo was created for individuals who are deaf or hearing impaired. The Sound Sense was funded by a Kickstarter back in July by the startup company Furanexo. It's supposed to help notify deaf individuals of warning sounds. This means anytime a siren or car horn goes off, the sound sense will turn the loud noise into a vibration to warn the wearer. Number 15, Community Help. This is a Facebook tool that will later be available to users sometime in 2017. It's supposed to help connect users in the aftermath of a natural disaster who will require food, shelter, and assistance. The users will be connected to others who are offering help or are in need of it. Number 14, an iris scanning system. This system was created by the United Nations World Food Program that helps provide Syrian refugees with food. The scanner only needs to scan the person's iris during checkout. Some of them are already being used in Jordan and are said to provide more security and safety than standard payment cards. Number 13, the transit elevated bus. This bus in China was launched in May of this year and is able to fit 1,200 passengers at once. The kicker, this bus actually drives over cars and they are all able to pass through it, like going under a bridge. This was created to help reduce the number of traffic jams, pollution, and overall just increased road space. However, it was recently discovered that the transit elevated bus might be completely scrapped altogether. Number 12, the Dignity Socket. This ingenious prosthetic was created by the German startup Ampero as a way to help low-income amputees get an affordable and modern prosthesis. It's reported that up to 80% of amputees around the world don't have the access to modern prosthetics that they can easily afford. The Dignity Socket is able to be remolded and only takes two hours to be custom fitted to the user. It can even be changed to fit the wearer's limb size. Number 11, a new way to test for Zika. It seems only yesterday that the Zika epidemic broke out. Oh wait, that was literally this year and back in 2015. This had researchers frantically looking for some type of cure to help battle the virus, but we also gained a new way to easily detect it by using this cost-effective device. Researchers at MIT made this for the hefty price of $1. This paper test has purple dots that will turn yellow if traces of the virus are found in the individual's blood. Also, the test only takes three hours for the results, whereas the normal test takes days. Number 10, Liam. Meet Liam. This robot here is a creation of Apple that was finally launched earlier this year after being in development for almost three years. Liam here is able to take apart an iPhone 6 in 11 seconds and sort out the parts in order for them to be reused and recycled properly. Liam can be found in Apple's headquarters in Cupertino, California, and plans for a second Liam in Europe are already in motion. Liam's ability to help was, however, questioned by Greenpeace. Number 9. Edible Food Packaging The plastic from traditional food packaging is quite the problem, as it's non-biodegradable and ends up in landfills by the dozens. We're literally killing our planet and turning it into a giant waste bin. Thankfully, there are some people in the world who actually care about the earth and are coming up with creative ways to save it. The scientists at the U.S. Department of Agriculture helped create this biodegradable film made out of, wait for it, milk. It's 500 times better at keeping food fresh than plastic. Number eight, the Pouncer Drone. This drone isn't like all the others that you've seen on the market. Oh no, the Pouncer Drone was specially created to help those in need of assistance who are in remote areas or can't be reached because of impassable roads by delivering some much needed relief items. These items include food, the frame of the dome that can be used as firewood, and the wings that have special covers that can be used for shelter. The prototype was created by Wind Horse Aerospace, and the company hopes this will become more than just a prototype in the next year. Number seven, liftware. For those individuals who are afflicted with certain diseases such as Parkinson's or cerebral palsy, eating can be a rather difficult task due to the offset of shakiness that is a common symptom. This can leave them feeling depressed over their loss of independence. Liftware is designed with them especially in mind to give them that sense of independence back. Tiny motors and sensors are in the handle that help stabilize the utensil. The head is also detachable and can be used for either spoons 
or forks. Number six, the Safari seat. Wheelchair accessibility isn't really something that able-bodied people have to necessarily think about, but that doesn't mean the rights of non-able-bodied people should be ignored. Moving around in a wheelchair can be unimaginably hard, but for those who live in developing areas where the terrain is rough and unsmooth, that's another challenge altogether. That's why the Safari seat was created out of recycled bike parts and uses hand levers to move it forward with its sturdy wheels. Production is expected to begin in 2017 in Kenya. Number five, the Parrot Disco Drone. This drone was introduced earlier this year after undergoing a multitude of tests and prototypes. The finished product was created with a total flight time of up to 45 minutes and is equipped with a 14 megapixel camera directly on the tip of the drone's nose. If you get tired of flying it yourself, you can activate the autopilot feature that will help you fly it with assisted controls. Hopefully, you've saved enough money as one of these will end up costing you $1,300. Number four, the Nifty Cup. For those of us who live in first world countries, we are, in a way, shielded and left completely oblivious to the struggles of the individuals who live in the third world countries, and it's very easy to turn a blind eye. The Nifty Cup was created for children in developing countries that aren't able to properly latch on to nurse. For just one dollar, these cups are able to prevent newborns from becoming malnourished and dying. This was a collaboration effort between the PATH Organization for Global Health, the Seattle Children's Hospital, and the University of Washington. Number three, biodegradable six-pack rings. It's such a tragedy that each year, millions of marine wildlife will end up swallowing some form of plastic, and most living species of fish and seabirds are currently living with plastic lodged inside their bodies. We as a species need to take responsibility for our actions and come up with a solution to help solve this crisis. That's exactly what the Saltwater Brewery in Florida did when they created these beer rings that are made out of wheat and barley. They're completely safe for animals and people to munch on. Number two, Lika. This cute little Tamagotchi looking toy is called Lika and it's made specifically to help children who are born with autism. Basically, what it does is that Lika helps autistic children by motivating them to develop a sense of autonomy when they play independently. Lika is able to play music and sounds to better engage with children and also talks, vibrates, and lights up for multi-sensory stimulation. Lika can even be adjusted to fit the personal needs of each individual child. You can now pre-order your very own on Indiegogo. Number one, Boomy McBoomface. Not the most professional sounding name for this innovation, but it doesn't really matter what it's called because this thing is going to be revolutionary. This idea has been in the works for the past five years when Boyan Slat, a Dutch entrepreneur, came up with this concept back in 2011 at just 17 years old. The device is supposed to help gather any weight while it floats in a coast and helps clean up the ocean. A prototype was put into place earlier this year in June after more than $10 million in funding. <laughs>